I'm Lel Tone, Eddie Bauer Ski Guide, and we are here in the beautiful islands of Hawaii. Hawaii has blown all of my expectations. It's been on my bucket list for years. It's just a place that I've never been. I've been really fortunate to travel all over the globe and go to some incredible places, but the Hawaiian Islands have completely blown my mind and surpassed my expectations. It's incredible to be in a very, very rural part of the island where you can see the rich history here. You can see the agriculture, you can see the traditional values, you can see the love for the earth, um, and really the, the relationship that native people have here to the land, to the ocean, to the sea. And I think the moment we landed here, you can really feel that you feel that this is a very sacred and special place. And so I feel so incredibly fortunate to have been able to come here and feel welcome by the locals and to see this place in its rural, raw, amazing element. One of the coolest days for me was when we jumped in the Jeep and drove down the road. You know, our mission was to get to the end to where the state highway ended. Basically, the highway ends right into a bay, right into the ocean. And so that was kind of all we knew. And to be able to take in the views, to see the ecology change, it's amazing with the rain shadow and way the weather systems come out of the Pacific. This island has such a diverse ecosystem. And so to be able to drive through some of that and explore was an amazing way to see the island. I think one of the greatest joys, especially as a guide, whatever medium you're working in, is being able to teach and show and share that experience with people. So being able to take Andrew out and kind of teach him the basics of paddleboarding, to come to the Hawaiian Islands, the birthplace of stand-up paddleboarding, and to be able to experience it on the waters here, out in the middle of the Pacific Ocean has just blown my mind. All of adventuring is, is not knowing what's around the next bend. And we were able to get him kind of dialed in on his paddling and work our way up this beautiful river. And again, it's just, let's go together and see. And a huge part of this trip has been seeing what's around the next bend and taking in all the beauty that this island has to offer. Feel it, can you feel it? Put a little sunshine in your heart Feel it, can you feel it? Put a little sunshine in your heart It feels so good So I've done a little bit of casting and a little bit of fishing prior to this, so but to have Adrian be able to break it down step by step is something that I've never been able to experience. Working in a very male-dominated field, it is so refreshing and so nice to be able to learn from another woman. I think the most amazing thing about casting and casting properly is you feel it. And so to have her constant feedback and to get that feedback and feel it all at the same time, such an awesome experience. And man, she is really good at what she does, you know, and was really able to break the process down and make it really clear. And I feel like I am a much better caster after listening to what she had to say. Feel it. Can you feel it? Put it in sunshine in your heart. It feels so good. And how about it, you guys? Really limes off the tree. I know, unbelievable. So I was having a talk the other night with Adrian and Bennett about yoga and how important it is to me and how much it's actually a part of my world now and what it's brought to me in terms of body health and longevity, uh, doing the things that I love to do. For me, there's nothing better than going to a beautiful place, like being here in Hawaii, looking out on the ocean and being able to be present and be focused and take care of yourself in this amazing place. <laughs>